I heard what happened under the Artemis Tau Cluster. The Council wasn't too happy about the destruction of those Prothean ruins. This isn't a game, Ambassador. Shepard's out there trying to stop Saren from destroying the galaxy. I know, I know. Just try to be a little more careful. The Council's watching you, and we all get judged on how you behave. Yes, Commander? Any extra intel you can give me on our colony at Pharos? The entire planet used to be one giant Prothean city. Mostly ruins now. But some of the infrastructure is still intact. The colony tried to build on what the Protheans left behind. We lost all contact with them when the Geth attacked. I should go. I'll be here if you need anything. Commander Shepard, it's me, Conrad Werner. Remember me? There are rumors on the extranet that you've been made the first human specter. That's incredible. Right. Conrad. We talked a while back. You remember me? Wow. Even while you're out there kicking ass, you don't forget the rest of us. That says a lot about you, Shepard. Hey, can I get your picture? Sure. No problem. Just hold up your gun. Perfect. Thanks again, Commander. I'm gonna hang this in my living room. My wife will love it. I need those supplies for my clinic. I can't. You can and you will, or your story won't stay secret for long. Don't disappoint me, Doctor. Oh, Commander Shepard. I didn't see you coming. Who is that on the vid? What do they want? Someone from my past. I can take care of it. I might be able to help you. I was fired by my previous employer for giving out free medical supplies to clinics like this. They never filed any charges, they just wanted me to leave without any fuss. But somebody must have found out. Now they are blackmailing me. I have to give them what they want. If the board finds out about my past, I could lose my license, they'll shut my clinic down. Maybe I can get you out of this. Tell me what they want. I have to give some of my medical supplies to a merchant in the markets. They expect delivery today. Give me your contact's name. I'll deal with this guy, whoever he is. Deal with him? But won't they expose my past? They won't bother you again. I guarantee it. I see. Maybe it's better if I don't know anymore. I was told to speak with a merchant named Morlan down in the markets. I really appreciate this, Commander. Thank you. Don't worry. I'll take care of this. Good luck, Commander. Be careful down there. Hello there. Welcome to Moorland's famous shop. You want many good supplies, yes? You were expecting a delivery of medical supplies? But I was told the doctor would be bringing them. Change of plans. A change, but the doctor... I don't... This is not right, human. Shut up, Moorland. I told Baines you'd screw this up. What the hell's going on here? Who are you? Leave the doctor alone, or you'll have to deal with me. We can end this if you just bring me those supplies. Otherwise, I'll start telling people about the doctor's little secret. Her secret stays buried, or I bury you. Hey, hold on! I'm just the middleman here. This is way more than I bargained for. Thank you, human. It is good to see him humbled so. What do you know about Baines? I have never met him, human. I only worked with the one who spoke with the doctor. Goodbye. Yes, all right then. Good tidings to you, human. Commander. How did things go? He won't be bothering you anymore. Really? That's a great relief, Commander. Thank you. 
I can't pay you for your help, but I can give you a discount on any supplies you purchase here. The thug said he worked for a man named Baines. Sound familiar? Baines? I wonder if he means Armiston Baines. We worked together a long time ago. What can you tell me about him? Last I heard, the Alliance military was contracting him for some research in the Traverse. I wonder if the captain knows him. We'll see what the captain can tell us. I wish I could tell you more. Is there anything else I can help you with, Commander? I'll be going now. Goodbye, Commander. Nice talking to you. Yes, Commander? What do you know about Armiston Baines? Where did you hear that name? Never mind, I don't want to know. Baines is dead. Has been for quite some time. The people I spoke with seem to think he was still alive. It's not common knowledge. Military is keeping it under wraps. Baines was doing some high-level work for the Alliance. Stuff even I wasn't aware of. One day he turns up dead on a drifting scout ship. Everyone suspects it was foul play, but it was never officially investigated. This is a cover-up if I ever heard one. I don't know much about it. You should talk to Admiral Kohoku. One of his crews discovered Bane's body. Any idea how to find him? Last I heard, he was up in the tower trying to get the Council to investigate Bane's death. Is there anything else, Commander? I should go. I'll be here if you need anything. No, I'm... Congratulations on becoming the first human Spectre, Commander. I'm certain you'll be up to the challenge. I appreciate that. My name is Admiral Kahoku. It's about time the Alliance got one of our own in with the Spectres. We need people like you to deal with our problems. Is something wrong, Admiral? I'm getting stonewalled by bureaucratic assholes. <laughs> Nothing new. Maybe you can help me, Shepard. One of my recon teams was investigating some strange activity out in the Traverse. We lost contact yesterday. Now I can't get clearance to check it out. Suddenly, it's a restricted area. But that doesn't apply to you, Shepard. Spectres can go anywhere they want. You could find out why my team dropped out of contact. I'll find them, Admiral. I appreciate that, Commander. I was running out of options. I'm going to stay here and see if I can find anything out through official channels. Won't hold my breath, though. I bet all these staircases aren't just for show. They make for good defensive positions if this place is ever attacked. Commander, any luck finding my recon group? Captain Anderson said you had information on Baines. Not as much as I'd like to. One of my crews found him, frozen stiff on board a derelict vessel. The missing recon group? The one I sent you to find? They were scouting the system we found Baines' ship in. I have to go, Admiral. Commander. Hello again, Commander. I've got a proposition for you. Since you helped me get information on the Crime Syndicate, I've gotten a lot more backing from my publishers. I'm investigating traffic controller conditions now, and I wondered if you could help. That seems like a step down from wide-scale corruption. Actually, in a way, it's more important. This isn't about people getting rich. This is about safety. I've heard rumors that the space traffic controllers are overworked to a dangerous degree. I can't get into the control room, but you could. If you planted a bug inside, I could crack the story. Everyone knows space traffic controllers are overworked. How is this news? There's a difference between overworked and dangerous. Traffic at the Citadel has increased by 300% in the last century, but traffic controller resources haven't kept up. We already have several last-minute wave-offs per week. <laughs> Do we have to wait for a full-blown disaster? If you crack this story, what's likely to happen? Ideally, there will be calls to improve working conditions by hiring more controllers and upgrading systems. The Council won't pay for improvements voluntarily. This story will provide that pressure. I can't promise anything, but I'll see what I can do. Give me the bug. Excellent. Just place it on a terminal with a good view of the area. Thanks again for your help. In the long run, this story is going to save lives. I hope he's okay. 
I'm on a break. Talk to someone else if you need anything. I've got a lot on my mind. Maybe I can help. Hmm. Well, maybe you can. You're a soldier, right? You ever head out to the Traverse? I'm not just some soldier. I'm a Spectre. A Spectre? I heard they were thinking about letting humans into the ranks. About time. Well, that means you can go anywhere you want, right? Even out into the Traverse? My brother's the captain of a ship called the Majesty. It was crossing the Traverse a few days ago when it disappeared. Just dropped right off the grid. And that usually means one of two things. They had massive mechanical failure, or they were attacked. Neither one of those options leaves a lot of hope. I won't give up on my brother. Not yet. I've got the coordinates for the last transmission from his vessel. Give me the coordinates. I'll forward them to your ship right away. Please let me know as soon as you find him. Commander Shepard, I am Nasana Dantius. I see you got my message. You said you had a job offer. I do. My sister Dahlia is a crewman on a cargo vessel operating out beyond the fringes of the Traverse. Her ship was attacked by privateers. There were no reported survivors. I'm sorry for your loss. This is where it gets complicated. Last week, I received a message with her voice on it. Dahlia is alive. The rest of the crew was killed, but she was taken prisoner. The slavers demanded a huge ransom from me in exchange for returning her unharmed. Why didn't the raiders kill Dahlia along with everyone else? My sister probably told them who she was. My family's very wealthy, Shepard. They must have realized she was worth more to them alive. You can't negotiate with criminals. It's too late. I transferred the funds to the account they specified. Only they never released her. They haven't contacted me since. I've made a terrible mistake, Shepard. I'm a diplomatic emissary. By law, I'm required to report any attempted extortion to CSEC immediately. But I was afraid for Dahlia, so I just paid the ransom. Now she's still missing. And if anyone finds out what I did, I could end up in jail. Why would they put you in jail? You're the victim here. Government representatives on the Citadel are not allowed to negotiate with terrorists. It's too dangerous. Paying a ransom would only encourage more kidnappings. I support the law in theory, but when I got the message, all I could think about was Dahlia's safety. I doubt they would actually send me to prison for what I did, but they would strip me of my post, and Dahlia would still be in the hands of the slavers. You want me to find her and bring her back? You only need to bring her back. I've already found her for you. I tracked the ransom payment through several accounts. Eventually, it led to a small mercenary band operating out of the Artemis Tau Cluster. I need you to go to the Merc base, take them out, and bring my sister back. You shall be well rewarded. Anything you can tell me about the Mercs who have your sister? Pretty much what you'd expect. Rough, dangerous, and well-armed. Nothing a Spectre cannot handle, though. Don't worry. I'll bring your sister back. Thank you, Shepard. I knew you were the right man for the job. Come back and see me when the job is done. I'm already getting readings. This is gonna make a great story. Thank you so much for your help. Here, this is everything I've got from my publisher's budget. It was no problem. Good luck with your story. It deserves to be heard. I appreciate your support. I hope this will save some lives in the long run. Thanks again for your help. I'm gonna show this to my publisher. Message coming in. Patching it through. Commander, Ms. Algelani's story on you just aired. I don't agree with everything you said, but at least you got her on your side. I just hope it doesn't damage relations with the Council. The Council can kiss my ass. I'm entitled to my opinions. When you wear that uniform, you represent the Systems Alliance military. As a Spectre, you represent humanity. There is one other matter, however. 
The Citadel has been trying to play down Saren going rogue. It makes the Spectres look bad. Your mention of him was politically inconvenient. I'm sure Saren inconvenienced the people he killed on Eden Prime, too. I'm on your side, Commander. Remember that. This comes from the Joint Military Command. I won't keep you any longer. Fifth Fleet out. Message coming in. Patching it through. Commander, we've got a situation that requires your expertise. A group of fanatical biotics have kidnapped the chairman of the Parliament Subcommittee on Transhuman Studies. They're afraid of sustained damage and is dead in space. Get in there and take them down. What are the biotics asking for? They're L2 biotics, and most of them are suffering major side effects from the implants. The subcommittee denied a request for reparations to all L2 biotics. Apparently they'd like the chairman to reconsider. What's the priority on saving the chairman? Saving him would be my preference, but we must make it clear that these tactics don't work, Commander. Your top priority is to neutralize the biotics. Understood, Admiral. I'll see what I can do. I appreciate you taking the time, Commander. I'm sending you the last known coordinates of the freighter. Good luck. Fifth Fleet out.
Kill the hostage! See how it is? You write letters and everyone ignores you. Force is the only thing people appreciate. So how about if I kill Chairman Burns and finish the charade? Please, I was trying to help you people. Let's not do anything we're all going to regret. Why not? What have we got to lose? Since the chairman here decided that we didn't get reparations, we've got nothing left to live for. But I've changed my mind. Seeing you all, it's, it's clear that you all deserve... You had your chance. Some L2s are nearly crippled from side effects of the implants, but you voted against reparations. Think about this. Burns is the one man who can help you. Yes, if you release me, I can take another look at the reparations request. What, we're supposed to trust you? I'm an L2 like you. Trust me, the commander can make sure that Burns follows through. Sure, you promise us freedom and say everything will be fine, but as soon as we surrender, you'll double-cross us. You're going to jail. But if you go peacefully, Burns will consider the reparations. Right, Burns? Absolutely. I had no idea that the L2 biotics were this desperate. If I'd known, the reparations will come. For whatever it's worth, I promise that. You're right. I don't want to die. Maybe something will happen this time. We surrender. Thank you, Commander. I thought I was dead when they took me. I'll see to it that the reparations discussion is reopened. I didn't know they were so desperate. Then you weren't doing your job. A fifth plate cruiser will pick you and the prisoners up. Message coming in. Patching it through. Thank you for dealing with the hostage situation, Commander. Chairman Burns was quite impressed by the way you resolved the situation peacefully. Your assistance above and beyond the formal duties has been noted, Commander. Fifth Fleet out.
This place looks abandoned. Securing point. According to these data logs, the survey team unearthed some kind of alien technology. Perhaps we will find more answers at the excavation site.
I'm picking up a signal from the planet's surface. It looks like an automated distress beacon. Looks like they were lured here by the distress beacon. <laughs> 